parents came here in the late 60s, early 70s from Pakistan, um, as have many other of my friends' parents who have come from India, Indonesia, Malaysia, Philippines. They left their countries, their homes, their parents, their brothers and sisters to come to this new country to settle because they knew there was a vast opportunity. Uh, we lived uh, in India uh, like joint family. Her father and you know her grandparents and everyone was taken care were taken care of by everybody who was in the home at the time. My mother-in-law had come to live with me and um, she had uh, many chronic issues and she was very dependent on others to do a lot of things for her because she was not able to do so. And I am scared to live alone. Her activities of daily living were very limited. Yeah, I have a history to falling down, so I fall uh, in Pakistan so many times. So my mother-in-law fell at midnight on Valentine's Day, and me and my husband were home. We were able to get an ambulance, get her, you know, to Henry Ford, and you know she had her recovery and everything. But if we were not home, and let's say she had no one, you know, what would have you know happened? When she came here, it was very difficult to find someone who could speak her language, who could cook foods that were familiar to her, that would provide the comforts of her home. I can eat mac and cheese, Kraft mac and cheese every day. My parents are not gonna have Kraft mac and cheese and a turkey sandwich every day. So how are you supposed to incorporate things from their culture and from their homeland and into the culture here, which they have done. But now this is a new transition of them being, you know, close to retirement. And how are we gonna offer those services? Because the kids are busy, they have their kids, and having this type of community involvement, which Abnagar is, she is being looked after properly. Well, like communication, we, uh, we can talk to each other, and uh, I feel safe and secure, somebody's here, and she's talking my language, and uh, she's taking care of me. It is difficult to somebody's come and different language, she's speaking different languages, and she's speaking my language, so it is easy for me and more comfortable. If you have somebody who can come into the home, not only do you have peace of mind, that your parents are safe and secure, but you also have the less added stress of having to um, multitask. You have now one task that's you know taken care of. So once you come home, you're stress-free and you're able to spend that time with your loved one. And that's what that's all that mattered.